everyone, it's the History Nerd, here with some more Civilization V Gods and Kings. For whatever reason, in my head I was about to say Civilization II, and that certainly isn't right. Uh, so, despite the horrid efforts with Germany, um, well I guess not really despite them, because of them, I've been practicing a little bit, uh, played a rather good game with the, Byz the Byzantines, and, um, now we'll just stick with continents. That's fine. All of that's fine. We'll leave that like that. Uh, however, I am going to go with my old standby, Force of Five, which would be Napoleon. So, sit back, relax, and enjoy hearing the narrator tell you about France. Eventually. Long life and triumph to you. First Consul and Emperor of France, Napoleon I ruler of the French people. France lies at the heart of Europe. Long has Paris been the world center of culture, arts, and letters. Although surrounded by competitors and often enemies, France has endured as a great nation. Its armies have marched triumphantly into battle from one end of the world to the other, its soldiers and generals among the best in history. Napoleon Bonaparte, France yearns for you to rebuild your empire to lead her once more to glory and greatness, to make France once more the epicenter of culture and refinement. Emperor, will you ride once more against your foes? Can you build a civilization that will stand the test of time? We sure hope so. Okay, let's take a look at what we got. Cotton, 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 wine, oh natural for the French. <clears throat> See if we can get a little bit. Come on, you can make it up the hill. Yeah, a little, a little thing there. Uh, we will just plop them down. That's looking like a really good spot for a city. I'm, I'm enjoying that. So first, first things first. Uh, we should, we should. Yeah, pottery. <clears throat> that sounds like a thing. All right, let's get this started. So, um, plan for this game. Because I think it's important to sit down and, and plan out... Well, I mean, this is really going to be the first... Maybe not the first time I've tried this, but... Usually I just sit down and play Civian and just like, we're just going to do whatever we want. This time around... Yes, I quite like that. And more ruins found. Look at that! Off in, the, off in the distance there, we got ourselves a little natural wonder. Not too shabby. Um, so yeah, <clears throat> the plan. I want to keep the Empire kind of small until I hit the Industrial Age. At which point I plan to expand, which is usually the way I go. Um, but keeping it small will theoretically allow me to focus on things that France does well. For example, culture. <clears throat> so, that's kind of the plan. Um, I've never got a culture victory in Civ Five, mainly because I always wind up just um, being really, really successful militarily near the end game. So, here's hoping in the wonderful world of... Um, recording and putting things out that this game goes according to plan. Uh, yeah. So that's, that's pretty much pretty much all I gotta say about that. Um, it's, it's strange, my inability to play with Germany in this game. I don't know what it is. But, uh, even in practice, the, the, I just don't play well with Germans. Don't know what it is. But thankfully, uh, with Matt's EU3 victory, if you guys haven't seen the, the little clip of his Gross Deutschland that he was able to create in that, um, check out his channel. It's pretty damn impressive. Uh, tradition, obviously. There's, there's no other question. It has to be tradition. Alright. Slowly moving along. Shall the clay say to him that fashioneth it, what makest thou? Yes, it should, because clay should know who made it. Uh, I guess pottery, not 
clay itself. Regardless. Uh, even after all this time, I'm thinking actually probably calendar would be best. I've got enough there that that's, that's kind of worth the effort to put into it. Uh, what else is there? Ah, Victoria 2, yes! So, in case you haven't seen any of the Crusader Kings 2 videos that I've done, uh, lately, which is only like two or three, haven't really been doing too many videos, apologies abound for that. Um, currently, I've got, uh, two of you guys from England, so that, that works well for you guys, um... Judging by that, we're probably going to have to keep it to weekend. Ooh, right, incense. Right on. Uh, we're going to have to keep it to weekends. Uh, unfortunately, I do have a job which prevents me from being around, except rather late. I think I'm eight hours, um, wet, eight hours west of England, of GMT. So, uh, yeah, the Free Culture Building. Hells yes. Um, so yeah, it's looking like weekends. If you are interested, please, please send me a message. Tell me what time zone you're in so we can figure this out. Is that already another sieve? I hope not. I hope that's just a river. That's far too close. Yeah, tricky. And in thinking of that um, Victoria 2 game, I do think that uh, as much fun as, as Asian nations would be to play or whatever, uh, probably would be best to go with uh, German kingdoms. So we could do fun things like tear apart Prussia, tear apart Austria, you know. <clears throat> really get into the, the fun what-if scenarios of Paradox Games. So that's... That's the plan for that, as it is now. Of course, these things do have a tendency to change. Um, I haven't really got too much of it planned out, so yeah. If you want in, let me know. That's pretty much step one. From there, we'll, we'll figure out the rest. Just quit with the barbarian spam, would you? Jeez. Yeah, I'm not worried about two. I'm fairly certain I can resist two attacks. <clears throat> Alright. Oops. Shifting off into the unknown abyss. Excellent. Yeah, we'll heal you up. Now that we got three around you. Hmm... Yeah. We'll just pull you back, heal you up. Aha! Uh, da -da -da -da. Garrison, that sounds good. Now, they shouldn't attack, and if they do, we should be able to resist that. Yeah, keep coming for me. Hide in Paris. And mining next. With our stone resources, that's that's kind of the next step. Well, we got cows too, so... You know, maybe agriculture would have been a better move. Who knows with these things? Actually, probably a lot of people know. I just, I honestly don't pay attention. Hello? People of the United States of America welcome you. Yes. Thank you. Don't Thank you, Mr. Him. Yeah. He sounds a bit like Bill Clinton. In my head, at least. I don't know. I don't know if that's just me. But 
I guess he's pretty busy. To me, Washington sounds like Bill Clinton in this game. Come on, lads, there we go. Yeah, you can keep building. Right? No, no. Ah, crap. What did I even tell you to do, anyway? Because that looks done. So I don't know what I told you to do, but you're going to wind up being captured. <sighs> Not paying attention. That's fine. We'll just recapture them. Ha <laughs> ha! Wasted effort, barbarians. Okay, go back down there, and let's get a cotton plantation going. And heal you up. Alright. Well, that's good enough. Yes, keep building. Even if he does come along and capture me, then, I mean, that's just going to be an easy way to recapture the worker. But, doesn't matter. Boom. Dead. Okay, we'll send you... Well, no, we'll just heal you up. We'll worry about giving you orders once, once you're feeling better and you're safe. Alright, we got our archer in place. You want spices? That's incense, so not quite. Uh, we will go with a shrine and we will purchase a scout. There we go. You can just chill there for now. Scout first. Explore. And you can go back to Paris. Excellent! And we will send you up there. Because we should kill those people. Spices! Perfect. Um, I do, I definitely want to try and keep my cities closer together this time around. Uh, I do think having cities spread out with massive roads connecting them is kind of bad for the economy. Thank you. So we got America and India on this continent. So that's... That shouldn't be too bad. If we run into China, though, oh, they're just going to get torn to pieces there. Poor tactical decision. But well, that's fine. We'll we'll recover. Yay! We got cotton. Now let's go get some wine. If only you could have killed them all. Thank you. Yep. 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 Come on. What do you got over there? Silk. This is this turned out to be a really good area, actually. You got more cotton down there, which would be a very good resource to add. Hmm. Although the spices are pretty necessary as well. We'll we'll see. Once we get the uh the shrine built up, we can start generating some faith, which is good for things. Uh, in fact, in one of my other videos, I'm not sure which one it was, but there was a question about what is faith good for. Um, it does give you bonuses. Uh, we're not really building any wonders yet. That sounds good. 
and I shall demonstrate the bonuses it can provide eventually, once once I get the chance to here. We'll go with masonry. Yes, yes. I have a feeling that's... Ah, and they're right up there. Son of a... Well, there's the first Civ we're going to have to take out. For obvious reasons, the Mongolians are really warlike. And they like to conquer people. So, yeah. We're going to have to really focus on defenses against them. Which sucks. Ugh. <sighs> no, we need... We really need to get our strength up. Because taking that will then be out in the open and we'll get shot to pieces. So that's a pain. Oh, hello. What the? Might need to get myself another scout just to scout out the south here. What? I'll pull you back and heal. Get you the F out of town. Alright, well, yeah, I guess you'll... yeah. Not quite fully away. But we'll make up some distance here, scouts, don't worry. We won't let these barbarians push you around. Uh, considering their health, we'll do that. And get the, uh, the training for the archers. That's a good thing, those guys are already... There, we should repair our cotton. Yep, yep. And run! In you go! Repair that. You can just chill there and heal. Good. Ah, uh, let's see... I'd really like to get another scout before I plop down a settler. So we'll do that. Uh, yeah, we work together, Washington. For now... Have they already built a second city? Like, that's... they must have. Ridiculousness. Come on. them to pieces! And there we go. You're no longer a threat to me. That's nicely repaired, so yeah. Oh no, we'll get we'll get more cotton. See if we can't start trading. No, we're not quite rich enough to afford a settler. No, nowhere near. All right, so we'll just we'll leave that. and go back to exploring. Is the following trade of interest to you? We'll take your money, sure. Come on. Made it Yes, we can work together, Gandhi. And 
probably up next we should go for... I'm really tempted to get writing. Because that's, that's useful for many things. Alright, scout! Go scout out the south. And can we finally make a move to get rid of that encampment, provided the Indians haven't done it already? Hopefully. Wonderful. Mount Fuji. Ah, oh. oh, so close. So close to being dead. Way up north, don't care about that. Come on, hack him, kill him, death! I'm really not sure that was worth the... No, oh, there's a lot of spices, so maybe a city right there would be a good spot. We got some... We got some production bonuses, we've got bananas, and then we'd expand into spices. Yes, that's looking like a very good spot. Those barbarians, they know what to pick. Thank you. Excellent. Um, yeah, that, that's looking like a good bet. And head south. Alright, and you can head south too, because we've got things to take care of down there. Oh, they're even cultured. They would make a very good friendly city to have. I guess I can set him to auto-explore now. Heal up! And where do we want to send you? We'll send you to the other plantation. Why not? And yes, you can just explore automatically. Just avoid the spearmen that were down there. You kind of did. Good. Oops, no, not wanting to end the turn just yet. Explore! More archers. That's really not worth it. And there's Washington. They got they already got a fair sized military. Is the following trade of interest to you? Mmm. No. We're sorry it's caused a divide, but we're not in the the interests of giving charity. Especially not this early on, where it'll just become, well, you know, we've you've been giving us been giving us cotton forever, so how about you just keep giving us cotton? I want something in return for my cotton. And hack them to death. That's not too bad. Uh, just just wait it out. We'll see. We'll see what happens there. Jeez Louise, it's taken forever to build this settler. Me yes! Too? Keep sending me money. We've got quite a bit of money now, actually. What can we what can we do for Paris here? Walls would probably be a good idea. We're gonna need another worker, so we'll go with that.
He who destroys a good book kills reason itself. Indeed. Uh, wheels. Good, you're back on your feet. Almost ready to get going with that warrior again. Good. Uh, spearman. What? So, America comes walking past this barbarian camp, and they don't even bother to attack it. Sometimes I wonder about the AI. Really do. Excellent. Uh, yeah, now we'll, we'll get those horses. At least I don't seem too interested in killing my settler, for or scout, for now. <sighs> Are you kidding me? You couldn't just hit that extra one, could you? Had to leave him. Flee! Come on, come on, come on, come on. Hit him, hit him, hit him. Wow. There we go. About time. Oh, good. We're friends with Florence because of that. Then it was worth the wait. Now we'll send you back north to heal in the beautiful borders of France. And some more pol come on, some more policies to adopt. Yeah, we'll go with that. Why not? Might as well build some sort of monument at some point. <laughs> Yay! A golden age already. That's wonderful news. Ah, good, good, explore. So I'm guessing India's somewhere over here. I think that makes sense. Which means, theoretically, we've got all of this area for France, which is wonderful. Alright, so with people moving into the classical age, it might not be a bad idea to make the jump ourselves. And nothing says classical era like catapults. Oh, 52, that's going to take ages. But it feels worth it. Hmm. You know, though... Well, what can we purchase? We can purchase basically any building we want. Ah, stoneworks. That'll even boost happiness. And production. Yes. There we go. Oh, that... That was great. Where? Th look at that! I'm really starting to get to know this game. And we've got the wheel. So we can go ahead and start building the road as well. You are nicely healed up, so let's head north and make sure there's no more barbarians up there. That the settlers are going to see first. Hmm. Yes, we should change that around. So we'll just hold off for that. And that.
Wonderful. Thank you. <laughs> oh, nope. Come on. Let's get the troop movements done first. Like so. And what are you thinking? Farms. It's really all about about all I can do in that area, so we'll just... we'll build some farms. That's a good idea. People need to eat. Way over there. Couldn't care less. No, give me the warrior first, please. Thank you. Ah, you see? It's a good thing I did that. This time I wouldn't mind having the settler first. And there we go. Oh, look at that. In range and everything. There you go, Mongolia. I'm helping you out. That is pretty close to their city. They might not enjoy the uh, the closeness of Orleans. But I don't care. Uh, let's see. I'm thinking shrine would be would be a good idea there. Now, so what does faith do? Here's a great overview of um, some of the bonuses you can get from increasing your faith. So, starting our pantheon, we're going to pick any number of these things that um, will just just give our give our culture a little bonus. So, taking a look, uh, we don't really have many pastures. Like, we'll have a few, but that would be really helpful to be able to... I guess I can just do that, can't I? So, we'd have two... That's, that's not really worth it. Um, what else have we got? I'm really thinking about Ancestor Worship, because I will probably wind up having a shrine in every city, and that gives me another culture, which will be incredible. For, for France. Um, plus one culture for each... Plus one culture and plus one faith for each wine and incense. So that would be um, two once we get that. Again, not really what I'm looking for. Um, each gold and silver, we have neither of those anywhere near, so that doesn't make much sense. Jungle tiles... Yeah. Ancestor worship is going to be probably the best bet to go. And you can see now with the little lightning bolt, those are those are the followers of our faith. So yeah, I think I'm going to leave the video there for today. So uh, thumbs up if you've enjoyed this. Do I have a France save? No, I don't. Okay. Thumbs up if you've enjoyed this episode so far. Leave your comments, questions, concerns, thoughts, jokes, musings, what have you below, and we will need to do a backup as well, just in case. Excellent. So, thank you all very much for watching, and we'll see you next time.